Here's another video for today. Uh, I'll be showing you how to use ChatGPT in order to get movie recommendation and then import these in the Monkey Semantic Player application. Uh, you could actually use uh, any Semantic Player, Motion Monkey, possibly Motion Box in the future. So here we'll type a message to the AI there. We'll ask it for 10 movie recommendation. Actually, we'll put science fiction here for the sake of it. So it should write a bunch of um, movie uh, titles along with their date here and links. Keep in mind, I'm using the entirely free chat GPT, so I'm not paying for this. It's the old version, so it's 3.5, if I'm not mistaken. And so, yeah, we'll just do that. So here, as you can see, I've got a bunch of links. And so what we're going to do here, we got a, a text document open. So I'll just copy paste this and put it in the text document, right? just, just like that. And then So next, I want to add um, a well-known <laughs> movie franchise here. I'm going to do just that. There's a few of them, actually. So I'm writing fairly um, generic request here just for the sake of the demonstration, but you could go pretty, pretty much in depth with your questions naturally. Okay, that should be most of them. All right, there's a lot of them. So we'll just, once again, just get there and open these without paying attention too much to the, to the aspect of the document, really. So even if it's the older version of the, of the AI, it's fairly good. It's very comprehensive when it comes to recommending movies, as long as they were published before 2021, if I'm not mistaken. So here we go again. Should be these. Can you provide 10 more links, please? 10 more movies. We'll see if it can pretty much suggest a few other that's more or less that are more or less related to uh, what we shared before. I'm not entirely sure it took it into account. Yeah, maybe that version is not too good at that because they don't really seem to be related to what he shared before. But anyway, you get the idea. So we get there. There'll be 10 of them. Yeah, that's fairly generic. Never mind. I'll just go there. And there. Next up, we want to save that. So I've saved in a movies file here. And we want to take the monkey, open the monkey, drag and drop the file. And there we go. So first off, we got the 10 recommendations, science movie, science fiction movie recommendation on top of there. Then we got uh, Star Wars. There, each canonical Star Wars movie, then the 10 recommendation at the end that he gave me. Here we go. And so what's convenient here is that I can just pick one 
I'll pick the best of them here and hit play. And I've got the trailer running here. I could search for related and that's all the related movie to that one. So we can play another one. You know, I'll pick the best one. Let's go. Great. Oh, that trailer is not very high quality. Go back to the history here. Uh, yeah, so we're back at our history here. I don't know. Let's open another one. Let's go Last Crusade here. Yeah, what's related to that, by the way? Okay, that's cool. Go, go back, go back to the first trailer. Yeah, so this is how you get a uh, recommendation for JGPT and then import and open them transparently in uh, the Monkey application. Uh, you could even upload these links, copy paste this, this link to a no paste uh, online uh, service so that you can share this uh, list universally and access it from any semantic player uh, in the world. Thank you for your attention and see you on the next one. Hopefully it will be useful for you.